Well, people cure Graves' disease. I guess you can see the cure shows on Graves' disease over there on the, uh, you know, right near this movie. You know, if I were you and I was on the Graves' disease cure show page watching this movie, I'd probably be listening to what I was saying and at the same time I might even be surfing up and down looking at the uh, various cure shows that are on the page. And one thing you'll see is that we haven't got too many cure shows on Graves' disease. What that means is we want you on the cure show <laughs> if you've got Graves' disease because we can cure it with you and we'll demonstrate how to cure it. Usually, you know, a couple of volunteers show up to sh show you the fine points of curing whatever it is you came to cure. And in this case, you know, originally when we started, you know, teaching this to people, like generally now what we ask you to say is, um, you know, I'm connecting to my ability to cure stuff, you know. But back in the days, you know, when we were, you know, f f doing it earlier, we used to say, I'm connecting to my ability to control my immune system. And since Graves' disease is an autoimmune disease, <laughs> you know, what you want to know is you're right up our alley here with this. <laughs> this is what we do. We show people how to control their immune system. Like this, I, I learned this early in the mid-90s when I was showing people how to cure HIV before we had a cure show and before we had videotaping of them, you know, when I was just uh, walking around with them, showing them how to do it. And what I, what I noticed was that they were taking back control of their immune system. So this is what you're going to be doing. You're going to take your... Uh, your thyroid back, <laughs> basically, and, uh, you know, stop the symptoms, which you can find will stop within hours of doing this. I mean, th this is very fast, you know, and so I recommend that you, d well, here's what I think you should do, how, you, how to go about this. First of all, before I tell you how to go about curing it, I want to say that there's something majorly wrong with this, which is it's very strange, okay? And uh, so there's a whole bunch of things in here that can easily turn you off, <laughs> you know, that you're going to be shown how to do or told to do so. So if you don't like strange, you may be stuck with your Graves' disease for the rest of your life because I don't know of any other cure than the things that we show you. <laughs> so, uh, and it's all in this book, okay? This is something, see I printed my, this is an e-book and I printed mine out in large type. It's, a, it's actually a six by nine book, but I printed it out in eight and a half by 11 because I, I like having a large, co large size copy of it. And it's got all the, you know, all the stuff that you're going to find on the website is also in the book. And it's e pretty easy. It's sort of codified with a whole million little tips. Like, I'll read you something from the book. What it says, um, it says, you have 12 bodies. Almost all illnesses originate in ones other than the physical. See, that's what I mean by strange. <laughs> So, uh, you know, this is a completely alien reality. Most people who have Graves' disease do not expect to cure it in a few days. You know, like, th they don't expect to have it be gone three days from now. So, when I tell you that, uh, you know, you can easily get turned off by it. <laughs> no kidding. And if you're not turned off by it, your spouse certainly will be. So, <laughs> Well, that's one thing you should probably know about this is like to, you know, not to expect the people who you love to get into it. However, the funny thing about it is that, you know, I do this kind of hands-on volunteer work where I go handing out bumper stickers on the highway. I stand by the left turn lane, I'm, I'm, you know, at the traffic light. I mean, I only do it for an hour at a time because I don't have much time, but, but I do enjoy, you know, like getting, you know, face to face with people, you know, it really, it's really wonderful. And as you can probably imagine, most of the people, you know, the bumper sticker says, you know, something like 54,000 cures and counting or whatever, you know, and uh, 
most of the people try to pretend I don't exist. But then you get all these people that are like, okay, people actually look at me, they look in my face and they say, I understand. And I say, people cure things and they say, I know. <laughs> you know, so that is an, an interesting thing that there's a lot of people out there, you know, probably not your husband, but there are a lot of people out there who actually know that people cure stuff. And at the end of, you know, an hour, people will have given me like $75 in donations and taken, you know, 40 bumper stickers. I mean, it's pretty amazing, you know, it really is. And I give a lot of the bumper stickers away without getting a donation because, you know, some people can't reach their money or whatever. And it's still, it adds up, you know, people want to fund things that are helping them. So anyway, okay, so now after having said, you know, gone into that tirade, I will tell you how to go about curing the Graves disease, the um, Graves disease. And the main, the main way that you do it is you do lesson number one and you learn to test. And then let's pretend that I have in this hand a list of bodies and in this hand a list of pathologies. And what you do is you take all these pathologies out of these bodies. That's the first thing you do is you get the body so that they're completely free of pathologies. Once you've done that, then you, f you go through the bodies again, one by one, and you find the ones that have Graves' disease in them, and you take those, you take the Graves' disease out of those bodies. And as you're doing this, you'll notice that you change. <laughs> There's a definite change that happens in you as you're doing this stuff. Um, which you'll probably experience when you're doing lesson number one. And uh, this change is cumulative. As you continue to do this over days and weeks and months, you never go back. You know, you actually become loving, serene, powerful, courageous, clear, all these things. And in the process of doing that, the side effect is that you lose your diseases. Like, I haven't had a flu come on since 1993. I haven't had a flu even try to come on. Like, nothing, you know? Other people, like on The Cure Show, they come in with the flu, 15 minutes later, it's gone. That's how fast it is. So, uh, you take this thing out, it's not going to be there anymore. <laughs> That's the bottom line. When you erase something, it ain't there, okay? <laughs> So, uh, okay, I think that that's a pretty good summary. And with that, I will send you over to lesson number one and let you get started. Enjoy.